Away from security matters now, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEX, says 41 of its offices have been attacked in 14 states from 2019 to 2021. INEC Chairman Professor Mamou Yakubu made the disclosure at the emergency meeting with security agencies under the EGs of the Interagency Consultative Committee on Election Security in Abuja Thursday. Professor Yakubu said that although the commission is still assessing loss of materials during recent attacks, preliminary assessments indicate that 1,105 ballot boxes, 694 voting cubicles, 429 electric generating sets and 13 utility vehicles were lost in the attacks. No doubt the last few weeks have been very challenging for the commission. The spread of arson and vandalization targeting the Commission's facilities and property has become a major threat to our scheduled activities and the entire electoral process. In the last two years, the Commission has recorded a total of 41 incidents involving deliberate attack on the Commission's facilities. Nine of these incidents happened in 2019 and 21 cases in 2020. In his remarks, the National Security Advisor and Co-Chairman of the ICEES, Major General Babagana Mugunu, retired mandated security and government agencies to deal with non-state actors plotting to disrupt the electoral process. The NSA assured that Nigeria's democracy will be sustained irrespective of efforts of divisive elements that are bent on destroying efforts of government. It is therefore important for us to sustain these processes which undoubtedly are not only internationally but morally accepted means of propelling ourselves into development in this century which is extremely turbulent and troubled. 